Hi everybody. We're gonna be doing a fire yakisabi spicy beef mukbang. This is some teriyaki chicken I had left over and I just cut it up into pieces. I'm actually gonna put that in here. And I have some salmon that I had. I decided to make some burgers. Can't really see it, but I decided to make some burgers with them. Um, so we're gonna be doing that, you guys. Sorry, we're gonna be doing that, you guys. And I will be back on to record and do the mukbang. Hi, you guys. How are you doing? Hope everybody's well and being safe. Before I go any further, make sure you guys are really, first of all, for all my supporters so far, thank you so much. I love you guys. You're awesome sauce. Um, TV Nation. <laughs> but um, anyways, before I go any further, I want to tell you guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you hit that notification bell so you can get tuned into all the things that your beautiful, lovely girl is doing. All right, so as you saw in the personal little clip I did earlier, um, we are going to be doing a mukbang. Sorry, I had to get my napkins. This chair is so loud. I had to get my napkins before um, we start because it's going to get messy. So, we're doing a mukbang, you guys. I have, I have, as you know, at fire, and see, I added, I don't know if you guys can really see it, but I added the chicken in there. And then, what you couldn't see before, is so I left it kind of out for you to see. Plus, I always eat it, like, on top like that is a salmon burger that we're going to be eating. So without further ado, let's get into this. And I'm going to be answering some questions um, some people had also. And just chit chat with you guys. Um, first, I got to say my prayer. So hold on. Amen. Alrighty. So, this is the fire spicy beef. And this is the yokosabi, if I'm saying it correct. That's what this is. Let's see. I hate when you're spinning. And it's like you can never get the noodles on there. Like, how are you guys holding up with this virus? Not too spicy. It's not too spicy. But. Yeah, how are you guys holding up the virus? I'm in North Carolina, and um, one minute it's like, oh, we're going to go back to normal, and then everybody went to normal, and now we got, like, one of the top states with all the viruses and cases. And that's crazy to me, because... It's like, people really got to take this serious. I've actually lost friends and family to this. You guys got to take this serious. So I'm not going to get into all the details of how I feel this virus came about and <laughs> the government and everything, but definitely y'all need to take this serious. And then... Also, somebody had asked me, um, me being a cancer survivor and having PTC and stuff, 
do I even go out? Yeah, I do. I have to be very careful though. Yeah, I'm drinking my water, y'all. I know. I've been drinking a lot of water lately. I mean, well, I always drink water, but I've been drinking more than I'm supposed to. And that's causing all this extra double, triple chin action. But I, I love my water. Um, so the noodles are good. They're just, I was expecting more. So after I finish my video, y'all already know I'm about to put it back in the pan and add my seasonings and stuff and, you know, do me. So I'm breaking a piece of the salmon burger. Oops. It is breaking apart because it is salmon. That's the salmon burger. Everybody's like, well, it's a burger. Put it with the bread and eat like a sandwich. I will. Mmm. See, putting it with the bread. I have hot sauce on it. And y'all gonna hate me for this. But I got Miracle Whip. I don't like mayo. And I have my spices and stuff. I was already cooking before I decided to just do a video. So, mm -mm -mm. that's good. That is good. So, I just wanted to do a couple of bites. Don't you guys? <clears throat> but yes, the questions was, am I going out? Even though I have, like I'm a cancer survivor and I have a pseudo tumor and stuff, am I going out like that? Yeah, I've been going out and you know, I have, I still have to do things, take care of the family and whatnot. So, yeah, I still been going out. I just make sure I'm safe and protected and pray to God, you know, the best I can. Um, like I said, you guys got to take this serious and actually protect yourselves and wear a mask wear gloves if you have them it seems kind of silly because it's like how is a piece of cloth that you make from home going to protect you from a bacteria and stuff but um just wear your mask, guys. Make yours at home if you don't have any. <clears throat> In America, you guys love the newest trend. And way before something came out, even though it was out, but before it came out, everybody was having these filters on Snapchat <laughs> with the mask. So, you know, bring the filters to real life. Wear your mask. And there's so many cute masks out there. People be really creative. Wear your mask. Okay. Just wear your mask. As I'm talking to you guys. I'm watching TV. Um, I thought that's what it was. It's Mission Impossible. Rogue. Rogue Nation. 
That's what I thought that's what that was. I'm like, what the heck is this? And then I'm like, yeah, I know what this is. <clears throat> I'm about to catch up on my Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Who watches Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Is anybody into Marvel or DC Comics stuff? I watch Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I got to catch up on my Runaways. Today is like my first day off in so long. Mm-mm-mm. The next question was, how am I doing? Because a couple of people saw, because I decided to let people know I had a miscarriage. And everybody's like, how are you doing and stuff, so I'm doing good. Um, I don't want to get too much into it, but I definitely would tell you God makes no mistakes. And I'm not saying that, like, in a good way, like, oh, I'm happy to know. Of course, I feel some type of way. But God makes no mistakes at all. When it's my time, if I really can then it's going to happen when God says it's going to happen. And I'm going to keep my heart and my my mind, body, and soul open to God. And whatever he says is going to happen. Um, as many know, or if you don't know, if you're new, um, I was told that I could not have children. So the fact that this is now the second time this has happened, well, the first time was an etopic pregnancy, and this time it's a miscarriage. But... You know, again, whatever God says is going to happen, it's going to happen. You know, but thank you everybody for, like, seriously, seriously thank you for all your support and kind words and and just love in general, you know. Thank you so much. You don't know, understand how much it helped. And let me be able to put a smile on my face. So, I greatly appreciate it. The next thing was, um, about my bingo. That looks good. I want some ice cold water, too. I'm about to get some. You gotta ice. This commercial is so crazy. He literally is in a desert. And there was a big thing of water. And he was crying from what I could see because I can't hear it. He was crying because he wanted to like get some flavor to his water instead of getting saved a helicopter came to give him some flavor for the water instead of saving him out the desert that's so crazy but anyways um yeah i do bingo games guys um i do host bingo games that it's just for fun this is not no gamble or nothing like that no 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 we just have fun. It's like family, friends, having fun. And sometimes we can win. Gifts, sometimes you just play to play. So, somebody was asking me because they saw me doing it and um wanted to know more information. So, that's what it is. It's just playing bingo, family, friends, whoever. And sometimes you win gifts and stuff, and sometimes uh, you just play. We're just playing, just to be playing, just to have some fun to do with each other. You know, it's all entertainment and fun at the end of the day. Okay. I wanted to do a short video, so that's why I said I'll answer like two or three of the questions. And I'm about to eat the rest of my food. I need my eyebrows done. Lord Jesus. I'm looking like a who shot dry. Mm -mm -mm. 
And then he shot us so low. Look at that hair. Look at this, y'all. Y'all see these? Y'all can't even see it. Let me see. I need to redo my braid. Look at that. There you go. My hair coming all up. You can see my hair. Look at this. Look at that hair right there. It's time to redo the braids, y'all. Anywho, even this up here, Lord help me. Look at this, Lord help me. Hey, for me to be doing my own hair is not too bad. Next time I'm going to try to record it a little more. And go check it on my other channel. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And click the notification bell. Click below in the description. Make sure that you add my other channel as well. So yours, okay? Thank you guys. Peace.